On the Shabbat by Mincha, we started reading the Parashat Chukat. This is here, out of Israel. We're going to have two Parashat this week, Chukat and Balak, whereby in Israel they're reading Balak, and now we, once again, reuniting with Israel, so to say, we're going to be having the same Parashat. So, Parashat Chukat. The parasha starts with Daber Hashem and Moshe and Aaron Nemor. God speaks to Moshe Rabbeinu and to Aaron and tells him, Zot Chukat Torah. These are the quintessential rule of the Torah. Asher Tziva Hashem that God commanded Lemo to share. And the Torah tells us now the laws of Para Aduma, the red heifer. In one word, the laws of purity and impurity. So when a person becomes impure, needs to be rendered pure by being sprinkled of the ashes of the red heifer. At this moment, I don't want to discuss the issues of the red heifer, which is in itself is the most fascinating subject, but I rather want to discuss what is the flow of the parashiyot. We concluded the story with Korach, Prior to that, we had the story of the spies of the Maraglim, the explorers, and now suddenly we come into Chukat. There has to be a connection. So the connection maybe is as follows. The Maraglim, the explorers, their mistake was that they did not want to get involved at all in practical mitzvot. They wanted to have the relationship with God only on a divine, intellectual, spiritual level, without having to come down into the physical mundane world, to be involved in the daily and make the daily godly. They were very content in being divine, living in the desert, living in their spiritual cocoon, and enjoying the blissful godliness. Korach said the opposite. Since what seems to be the most important is the action, so let's separate the action from the divine. Let's separate the action from the above. So everybody's holy. There's no difference between Moshe and Aaron and everybody else because the practical mitzvah, we all do it in the same way. There's no difference between the more learned, the more reformed, the more pious. The action is what counts. So he separated the action from the higher. Chukas comes now and says the rule. And he says, Zot Chukat HaTorah. The rule of Torah, which means the illogical or the supra-rational mitzvah for which we do not have an explanation is the basis of the whole Torah. In other words, that in the simple action we have to realize that really it is, there is a supra-rational concept. In other words, connecting the supra-rational with the mundane, with the simple, with the activity, with the simple activity that it is. And really we find this in the spelling of Korach and the spelling of Chukat. Korach and Chukat both have three letters. Korach has Kuf, Reish, Ches, and Chukas has Ches, Kuf, Taf. There's two letters that they have in common, which is the Ches and the Kuf. Where Korach has, in addition to that, the Reish, and Chukas has the Taf. What does this mean? The Ches and the Kuf means Chok, Zod Chukat Torah. That commandment which is beyond rationale. That commandment that we do not know the explanation for it. That commandment that we do fully only because God said so. So we have, they both have it in common. Korach and Chukas have it in common. But Korach has a reish to it. How is the reish spelled? There is a horizontal letter and there is a vertical letter. Uh, lines, I should say. So there is a, ver a vertical, a horizontal, and a vertical line. There is no third line, which this represents 
the thought and the speech, the rational separated from the action. Chukas has the tough, which has the horizontal, but has two vertical lines. In other words, the second vertical line is the action, where they combined, where the action is united, connected with the above. So Korach's mistake was that he wanted to make a disconnect between the rational and the super-rational. Chukas is that really it's all one. And that's what the Torah is all about. That when we combine every dimension of Torah, then we have purity. And when we have purity, we will merit to be able to go to Beta Bigdash. May we have it today.